Hey guys, my name is Shibu and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I wanted to show you an in-depth review of the Samsung DeX desktop software for Windows 10 uh, and Mac OS um, that will allow you to connect your Note 10 device to your Windows machine and get the DeX experience on your Windows machine. So you don't need to connect it to a monitor or a TV anymore. You can just use your Windows machine. So we'll look at both modes, connecting it to the Windows machine and also comparing the experience with the DeX experience with using it on a regular monitor or a TV. Um, so let's get started. In the S10 or S9, you um, have to use um, a USB to HDMI cable similar to this one I have here basically converts your uh, USB uh, C type C from your phone to an HDMI um, connection which you can connect to a monitor and then you get a full desktop experience so the new uh, Galaxy Note 10 has got this feature where you don't need to necessarily have a display device anymore you can connect the USB-C uh, to your Windows 10 machine and you can get a full desktop experience on your Windows 10. This is a feature that they are offering now only for Note even though the uh, hardware specifications and capabilities of the Note and S10 are nearly kind of very similar. I, I think S10 has got the uh, hardware capabilities. The S10 and S10 5G okay. both have it. Okay, so um, so even though S10 has got the hardware capability, they have locked this feature only for the Note, probably to increase sales, or maybe the, this feature will be available in S10 in the future uh, updates. I hope that's the case. So as of right now, this is August 25th, the DeX for Windows application is only available for Note 10 devices. I've already gone ahead and downloaded the Samsung DeX application and installed it on my desktop. It's very straightforward to install. Um, I will leave the link below in the description. And all I'm going to do now is to connect the Samsung Note 10 to my Windows PC laptop and hope it shows up. So that's the Samsung DeX uh, application running on my Windows PC and it gives me the full DeX experience on my Windows PC. So what I will do now is actually record the screen on my Windows and we will take a look at um, some of the applications, some application that I use on a day-to-day -day basis and see how the experience is running DeX on um, my Windows 10 machine. All right, so this is the Samsung uh, Dex desktop on my Windows uh, PC. Um, as you see, I can move uh, the desk application around. I can resize it. Um, there is not many options in the application itself. There is the setting menu. Uh, one of them is the auto start where when you connect the USB-C to your uh, Samsung device, it automatically starts the desktop application and the other one is notifications I guess to uh, show notifications from your device onto your desktop on Windows. So those are the only two uh, options that are there. Um, I can um, drag and drop files from my Windows to, um, to the Samsung um, application but what it does is it does not place it in uh, the desktop. It, puts it, for example, if it's an image, it puts the image into the images folder in a download folder in the images. So I can actually see the image that I can see and work on the images that I just dropped from my Windows machine. 
Um, unfortunately, I cannot do the same back, so I cannot move a file from there to Windows. Oh, okay, I can. It looks like it worked. Let me see. Um, okay. It copied something over and it's it's not the file I copied, it it copied a TMP file. I'm gonna try it again. Um, okay, drag it. So it's trying to copy a Samsung Dex.tmp file. I don't know what the TMP file is, but it doesn't seem to work the way that it's expected to. It's not copying the file, it's copying some other TMP file. Um, so it might be a bug. Um, so I can copy uh, files from Windows to Samsung device, but I cannot copy it back. But that's not much of a worry because I can go um, into my PC, I can see uh, the device here and I can copy files to and fro. So it's, you know, I, I don't think that's much of a problem, but if they claim that this is one of the features, um, then I would expect that it to work seamlessly. Now, by the way, um, this is a demo device that I borrowed from a friend of mine. He runs a shop here in Cochin called IT Net in Panapanali Nagar. So if you are in Kerala or Kochi, um, do check out that store. They have the latest gadgets. So I, I want to show you a demo of the Asphalt game on uh, the software. Um, I can resize this uh, application. Now I'm able to resize this because I um, turned it on in the labs option in the settings menu. So I'm able to resize the game, otherwise I will not be. And I can also resize the Windows machine, uh, the, the Windows um, application. So this is in full screen mode in Windows, tap to play. I can use the touch screen on my Windows laptop to interact with the Dex uh, application that works. The keyboard on the mouse works. But this game, the Asphalt game is just a demo. So uh, I'm not going to be able to play the game. Nor do I claim that I know how to play the game. So this is just a demo. I don't know how to play the game. So sorry. So I'll just quit this so I can resize the game and, and, and so on. Um, there you go. Is it the game? Okay. What else should I try? Okay. A uh, few other applications I tried. I, I, I tried um, YouTube and uh, that works out fine too. Oh, by the way, uh, if you haven't liked or subscribed to this channel yet this is a plug that i'm doing uh, to promote my channel so if you haven't uh, liked or subscribed to my channel i would really appreciate if you can do that um, it will mean a lot to me um, so youtube works videos work fine i did uh, find some problems with uh, two applications that i use um, netflix and uh, amazon video um, I'll show that those those applications don't work at all in uh, in the um, desktop app in the Windows application. Now um, you know the, this is not a big deal um, because of the fact that you can install these applications directly on your Windows, so there's no need to run this on your Samsung Dex and then stream it on your Windows machine. You can just run them directly on your Windows machine anyways. So uh, another um, feedback that I have about this desktop application is that it's not a native Windows 10 application. Um, so you know how um, Windows 10 applications let you snap this like, you know, like that, it doesn't really work this this application doesn't snap it just floats around the screen but you can do you know resize minimize uh, full screen uh, you can drag files on into the uh, desk application and um, you know those are things that you can do and there's a setting menu so it's a very very basic application
All right. Um, so Amazon Prime seems to work. Hmm. But it's not showing the video. Um, so, so I think the reason why Netflix and Amazon is not working, it might be because of some kind of content uh, protection that it's trying to do so people don't record the screen. These are just entertainment softwares. I tried, um, I tried Windows, Office and uh, Excel. I tried Windows, Word and Excel. I couldn't get it to work and I think it might be because there's some problem connecting to the server so I could not log in. Uh, other applications like Drive uh, and, and so on, Google Drive, you know, editing files um, and, and so on seem to work just fine. Um, you know, Google, Google Office applications seem to work just fine. Uh, so I think um, all in all, um, the, the experience that I felt uh, from using the Samsung um, Windows application is that it, it's a basic connection between you know it provides a basic desktop that you can get the Dex uh, application running on your uh, Windows PC it does not give the same experience if you would connect it to a TV or, or a monitor because the, mo the image on the monitor is much more crisp especially if you're playing games or if you're watching some content the the uh, the quality is much more better directly on, on a, sc a screen versus on a Windows machine. So I also tried a Linux on DeX which uh, is available um, as a beta which used to be a beta program that Samsung ran. ran. Um, I was able to get it running on my Samsung S10 so I wanted to try the same APK file um, with the Note 10 I did install the APK file. It, it's installed fine, but um, but when I tried to run the application, it says that the device is not supported. And uh, please visit Linux on Dex for more details. The last time I checked, there was no APK file in the App Store um, or anywhere that you could download it from. So the beta program is closed. And to download from here. Now if you're using S10 um, you can get um, Linux on Dex running. Do check out my other video. I do have another detailed video on how to install Linux, Ubuntu Linux on your uh, Samsung um, Dex. So now I'm going to try connecting the phone, uh, the Note S10 directly to the HDMI port using this cable let's see how that goes it's a screen. so I can either use the touchpad app on the phone to control the mouse and the keyboard on the screen or I can use a keyboard and mouse connected to the USB here and then use it that way the only one difference that I noticed, well, two differences that I noticed um, is that in the Windows application, you don't have this screenshot feature um, that's available when you connect directly to the HDMI port. Um, however, I guess you can take a screenshot directly from Windows application anyways, if you wanted to do that. And the other thing also is um, in the Windows now, uh, in, in when when you connect to the HDMI, you have the option to um, do a screen mirror of your uh, Samsung DeX, and the way that you would do that is by clicking here on the on the menu here. You know, there's an option to do screen mirroring. Um, let me try and do that just to show you. So I can do a screen mirror uh, instead of using the DeX when I am using the HDMI. Okay, so now I'm switched back to DeX. When you use your Windows um, application, some application don't seem to work correctly. Like for example, I showed you that Netflix application um, did not work correctly when using on um, the Windows uh, application, but it seems to work fine 
when using here on directly on HDMI. The quality that you get from a direct HDMI connection is much better than when that you see from the desktop application on Windows. My final thoughts, the uh, Samsung DeX application on Windows is useful for Note uh, 10 users. Unfortunately, it's not available for S10 or S9 or earlier versions. I hope um, Samsung changes that. So I hope you found this video to be useful. If you did, please hit the like and maybe even subscribe to my channel. And Faisal from ITNet, thank you for lending me this uh, device to do this review. Thanks, bye.